The cost of living in Birmingham. What is it like to live in Birmingham? Birmingham has gained a reputation for being a vibrant city located in the heart of England. The city offers a unique blend of cultural heritage that is a mix of people from different parts of the world. The city also has great economic opportunities, hence it is a top choice for people who seek greener pastures in the UK and abroad. What's more, the city has been hyped in recent times for its relatively affordable cost of living compared to other major UK cities. In this piece, we will delve into the full cost of living in Birmingham. Stay tuned. The indices used to measure the cost of living in Birmingham includes housing cost, transportation expenses, healthcare, everyday expenses and others. Let's delve into them one by one. Housing costs. The cost of housing is considered a significant component of the overall cost of living on a general level. And this would mean that if we were to examine the cost of living in Birmingham, we would need to factor this index into the cost of living in Birmingham. In Birmingham, the cost of house rent is way cheaper than in many cities in England and across the globe. For instance, it is estimated that the cost of renting a house in Birmingham is about 50% cheaper than that of the US. Furthermore, the cost of housing in Birmingham, according to a report, has decreased slightly in 2023. The cost of renting a house in Birmingham ranges from 500 to 2,500 or even more, depending on the number of rooms, location and amenities. If you are to consider living in the surrounding suburbs, rental prices are known to be slightly lower, ranging from 500 to 1,200 pounds per month. Compared to the city centre, where you might have to pay close to 1,500 pounds and above, and so, if you are just starting in Birmingham and on a low budget, it might be advisable if you settle down in the suburbs of Birmingham. In addition, you should also know that in Birmingham, you can either decide to pay for house rent every month or choose to pay annually. From observation, paying annually seems to be cheaper but is less flexible compared to the per month basis. On the contrary, if you prefer to buy the property, the average cost of a three bedroom house in a desirable neighborhood usually range from 250 to 500,000 pounds, again, depending on the location. Transportation expenses. Part of the indices used to evaluate cost of living is transportation expenses. It is very important to get familiar with the cost of transportation because it is something we get involved with every day. That said, Birmingham boasts a well-connected public transportation system, including buses, trains, trams and bicycles. However, it does not have an underground train system. The average monthly cost of a public transport pass is around 60 to 100 pounds, depending on how frequently you are on the road. Usually, the average cost of boarding a bus in the city is just six pounds. Alternatively, if you own a car, you should consider factoring in expenses such as fuel costs, insurance, parking fees and road taxes. These costs may vary depending on your driving habits, but on average, you can expect to spend around 150 to 400 pounds per month on transportation using your private car. Also, there are parking expenses and other local taxes to be paid. However, it is important to note that, because Birmingham does not have underground trains like London, the public transportation may be unreliable and slow at times. Healthcare. Healthcare is another indicator of the cost of living. Healthcare in Birmingham is provided through a combination of public and private healthcare systems, with the National Health Service, the NHS, serving as the primary healthcare provider. Of course, the NHS is the publicly funded healthcare system in the United Kingdom, which also extends to Birmingham. NHS, like in every other part of the UK, provides comprehensive healthcare services, including general practitioners or GPs, specialist consultations, hospital care, emergency services and mental health support. NHS services are free at the point of delivery for residents, regardless of their immigration status. Patients can access NHS healthcare through GP surgeries, walk-in centres and hospitals. Birmingham has several hospitals that provide a range of specialised healthcare services, including Birmingham Children's Hospital, Queen Elizabeth Hospital Birmingham and Heartlands Hospital. These hospitals offer services in areas such as cardiology, oncology, orthopaedics, neurology and more. Referrals to hospital specialists are usually made through GPs or other healthcare professionals. Also in addition to the NHS is the private healthcare. Private healthcare offers additional options for those who prefer faster access to treatment or specific services not covered by the NHS. Private healthcare providers may offer quicker consultations, specialised treatments and private hospital rooms. However, it's important to note that private healthcare comes at a cost and typically requires private health insurance or self-payment. 
The cost of private health insurance varies based on your age, medical history and coverage requirements. Everyday expenses Everyday expenses are also an index of the cost of living. Everyday expenses in Birmingham encompass various aspects of daily life, including groceries, utilities and leisure activities. When it comes to groceries in Birmingham, the cost may vary. Averagely, a single person can expect to spend around 30 to 80 pounds per week on groceries. However, this can fluctuate based on personal dietary choices, brand preferences and shopping habits. Discount supermarkets and local markets often offer more affordable options for budget-conscious shoppers. A family of four could be spending up to about £200 per week on groceries. Utilities are also part of daily or weekly expenses. Utilities like electricity, heating, cooling, water, garbage disposal and many more are just part of the expenses. These expenses can vary depending on factors such as the size of the property, the number of occupants and individual usage. On average, monthly utility bills for a one-bedroom apartment can range from £100 to £150. For a family of four, you might spend up to £300 or more. Dining and entertainment might also be something to consider. The cost of dining in the city of Birmingham is a bit fair. On average, a meal at a mid-range restaurant can cost around £12 to £20 per person, excluding drinks. For entertainment and leisure activities, costs can vary depending on personal preferences. Movie tickets typically range from £8 to £12, while gym memberships can range from £20 to £50 per month. Others include indices like internet and communication, personal care and clothing education. The cost of internet and communication services in Birmingham depends on the provider and the package chosen. Broadband internet packages typically range from £20 to £50 per month, depending on the speed and data allowances. Mobile phone plans vary depending on the provider and the selected package, with monthly costs ranging from £10 to £30 or more, depending on data, minutes and texts included. Also, for a family of four or more, certainly more will be spent on these utilities. The cost of clothing and personal care is relatively cheap and may cost you less than a few hundred pounds. You can easily get clothes in and around the marketplace for a few pounds. Clothes are generally cheap in the UK. When it comes to leisure and recreation, Birmingham is renowned for its vibrant cultural scene, offering a multitude of entertainment options. The city is home to numerous museums, art galleries, theatres and music venues. Many of these attractions have free or discounted admission, allowing residents to explore and enjoy the city without breaking the bank. Additionally, there are beautiful parks and green spaces throughout Birmingham that provide opportunities for outdoor activities, relaxation and family outings. For education, you can get a standard and affordable education in Birmingham. Although it is quite expensive than other cities, it is not as expensive as London. Public schools in Birmingham are funded by the government and do not charge tuition fees. However, private schools, including international and boarding schools, have varying fee structures. Tuition fees for private schools can range from £5,000 to £20,000 a year, depending on the level of education and the school's reputation. For university education, the cost of university education in Birmingham varies remarkably depending on several factors such as the university, degree programme and whether you are an international or domestic student. The maximum annual tuition fee for English and Welsh students studying in Birmingham is at least around £9,000 per year or could be higher. If you are an international student, tuition fees are higher for you compared to domestic students. In conclusion, moving to Birmingham is a good thing to do as it offers better opportunities and cheaper cost of living than other cities in the UK. But then, based on what you have heard, what do you think about this cost of living in Birmingham? Do you think it is cheaper than your current location? Let's have your thoughts and comments. That will be all for now. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment and turn on the notification bell.